if you're having trouble running Java on your PC, one thing you can do is you can try uninstalling and reinstalling Java. So you can go into Control Panel. This is for Windows 7 default programs, program features, and try to find all of your entries for Java in here. And go ahead and click on Java and uninstall. Go through the process to fully uninstall it. You'll see this disappear. And then you can open your browser and go to java.com. And so you can try downloading Java from their website over here. It's an online installer, so it's a small file. Over here it says, do you want to run it? It's already downloaded, and you run it. Um, before you do this, sometimes it's useful to go to your antivirus program if you have it running and disable it temporarily. So I have Norton, so I open Norton by going to my taskbar, right clicking on the icon, and I can disable smart firewall and disable antivirus auto protect. In most cases, you shouldn't have to do that, but sometimes. Uh, something happens to your computer and your antivirus program is trying to protect you. Uh, so it can prevent you from installing Java through the online installer. Uh, I usually don't prefer using the online installer. Instead, I usually go to download the offline installer. So you click over here. While you're on the download page. There's a link over here, see all Java downloads. You click on there and they actually have the offline installer so it's a big 27.6 megabyte installer. They include 32-bit and 64-bit version. So in most cases you'll want to install the 32-bit version. Um, if you're running Internet Explorer sometimes you'll have to install the 64-bit version. And so that's it. Usually I'll just click on this and let's see what it does. It'll let me download it and then I'll run it, install, and that's it. Hopefully reinstalling Java will fix your problem. Otherwise, there are some other things you can do to troubleshoot.